broadly speaking, the warranties will typically provide for um, the product, the the original manufacturing specification, right? Was the product made properly without defects? Um, and will it work? You know, if you turn it on, it works, right? You connect it, it works. That's kind of the the main thing. Depending on the product, depending on what the manufacturer is attempting to do with the product or the full warranty support, it might include more than just the product. It might include performance. And that's in the module space. We'll, we'll get into that here in a second. But there's usually a, two different numbers when we talk about the modules. Um, there's a product warranty and then a performance warranty. With inverters and, and batteries, typically it's, it's essentially just only a product one, but it's the performance side of it is sort of rolled in. And what we see commonly around batteries is it's got a 10-year or an 8-year or a 12-year warranty, but then it's also based on a number of cycles charge and discharge cycles. And so understanding what the intention was for how often this battery is going to be utilized, that's actually more relevant than the number of years. And if you think about like in the automobile industry, a lot of warranties are based on the miles you've driven, right? The harder you are on your vehicle, the less life it may have. If you garage it and you don't drive it, stands to reason that things maybe are going to last a little longer. So that's kind of typically um, the breakdown. The third category that can sometimes work its way into solar warranties is labor, um, installation support. Um, and that, again, I think is the, the push towards, uh, from the manufacturer standpoint, we want our high quality product installed by high quality professionals who are following our trainings and guidelines so that we can have the best user experience. And if they're willing to invest in installer reimbursement for failures of their product, that's a commitment to, to the industry, commitment to their partners to say, yeah, we maybe didn't get it right, but you shouldn't have to pay out of pocket to make that replacement. So we'll cover a truck roll, for example, to go out and swap out the inverter, right? We'll give you the new inverter as well, but, but we're also going to pay you a flat rate, right? $350 or something like that to cover the cost of the technician to go out to the site and swap out the product. So those are really the the three categories. 